Hello everyone, it's August 17th, 2009, and John and I are on our way up the uh, 405 freeway from Long Beach. We're going to uh, go out to Catalina Island today to uh, do some snorkeling. And uh, you can see I've got my adventure hat on. John, are you ready for adventure? Ready for adventure. So, crikey, stand by for adventure. So there she is. The uh, Marina Flyer. Anyway, we're standing on the front of the Catalina Flyer boat, and uh, they're just prepping everything, getting ready to uh, launch to depart. So here's where the captain sits, who drives the boat. And then uh, there's this little seating area back here, but there's also a big seating area underneath uh, where we're standing, and uh, we'll take you down there in a minute. But uh, you can see it's a very cloudy day today. It should be sunny out at Catalina by the time we get out there. All right, so here we go, heading away from the dock. <laughs> We're uh, taking off on this foggy morning on our destination of Catalina Island. Visibility here is, is, is sparse, but you can see some pelicans taking off. We did see a few seals in the inland. We're hoping to see some dolphins later. If you're going to puke, you be sure and tell me so I can get it on tape, all right? Oh, definitely. I'll even have you hold my hair. Experience, John. Dag nabbit, they were all out of them bagels. They ran out of bagels. How can you run out of bagels? It's not like they're some kind of exotic import. John's very disappointed. Did I already say shucks? So this is where the hardy souls hang out. Up on the top side, where you got the wind in your hair and the salt sea spray on your face. How are you guys finding the trip over? Fantastic.
house of wood novelties? I don't think in my neighborhood house of wood novelties is any place we need to set foot in. Again, Europeans think they can just take a nap anywhere. <laughs> Catalina's homeless. Right. Oh. <laughs> Topless tacos. And it's closed. The Bay of Seven Moons. So there's one moon in the sky. It looks like um, one of the seals is mooning somebody. It looks like one of the natives, two of the natives are mooning someone. I'm not sure where the other moons are. Good day, mates. So this cove behind me here is where we're going to be snorkeling. Hopefully we won't run into any man eaters. Okay, um, now everybody in my detractor said that I was way too fat for this wetsuit. And I just What's, wanted... What size is that wetsuit, John? It's a medium. Oh, oh, there's no way you're gonna fit in that medium wetsuit. And uh, it says it goes up to 185 pounds. And I'm 177.5 on a good day. So let's see how this works out. Maybe I am too far. <laughs> I think he's going to do it if he can just get that zipper up. A lot of you ladies can, can probably relate to that. <laughs> how do you feel, John? Can't get that zipper up? What's the matter? <laughs> what is the matter? Oh, what are you, how hard are you having to pull on that thing to get it up? <laughs> okay, folks, should I help John out? He's going to like land up cutting his back all up with his zipper if I don't help him. All right, there you go, John. How's that wetsuit feel? Feels like a million bucks. Oh, uh, too sexy for this suit. Too sexy for this suit. Well, John and I are gonna have a contest today to see who pees in their wetsuit first. Uh, these wetsuits don't have flies on them, and when you get in the water, it's really cold, so it makes you have to go to the bathroom. So uh, I'm thinking it's gonna be John. I'm taking a dump in mine. <laughs> All right, here we go into the water. All right, so we discovered it's almost impossible to swim and videotape at the same time. great day here at Catalina Island. The weather turned out to be perfect and I got to do some snorkeling and that was really fun. Water wasn't bad with the wetsuits on so that was really good and I uh, had a nice little lunch and uh, just uh, really relaxed but unfortunately it's almost five o'clock and five o'clock is when the boat leaves to go back to Los Angeles so regrettably have to pack in our stuff and head back to the boat. Walking back to the boat, don't really want to go home, I'd rather stay here where life is relaxing, but duty calls, got a video shoot tomorrow morning, it's going to be a tough one, it's also on the beach, <laughs> but uh, what can I say, it's a tough job.
Crikey, that was quite a day.